Hi, my name is Anika and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a brioche apple pudding and this is a perfect warm dessert for winter during the holidays. of brioche bread, half a cup of cranberries, six tablespoons of butter, three eggs, two teaspoons of vanilla extract, half a teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of cinnamon, one fourth teaspoon of nutmeg, three apples, half a cup of honey, and half a cup of brown sugar. You'll also need one cup of heavy whipping cream and one cup of milk. Now I'm gonna Whisk the three eggs together. I'm gonna add in the butter, the honey. If you would like, you could replace honey with sugar. The vanilla extract and all of the spices. I'm gonna put this aside for now and cut the brioche bread. And I have about seven slices. So I'm gonna cut it into thirds both ways. And you also need to leave your bread outside for at least like a day or um, so that like it's dry, so that it'll be able to soak up the liquid easily. Now I'm gonna add in the milk. And the heavy whipping cream. Now I'm gonna add in the brioche bread. Then leave it in there for 30 minutes so that it can soak up all of the liquid. Now I'm gonna set it aside for 30 minutes and work on the next step. I already peeled and cored the apples and now I'm gonna slice them. The next step is to Use a pan and put it on medium heat, and then once it once it's hot, you add the butter. I already used five out of the six tablespoons in the liquid mixture we made um, before, and I'm now using the remaining one tablespoon of butter. And once the pan is hot, then then you'll add the butter, and then just let it melt. Now that the butter's all melted, I'm gonna add in the brown sugar. sugar has melted, just add in the apple. And just leave it for five minutes. It's been five minutes and the apples have softened now and I'm gonna add in the cranberries. And also turn off the heat. Now I'm gonna let it cool. I'm gonna preheat the oven to 350 degrees. Now I'm gonna prep the pan by just taking some butter and um, like spreading it all around. I'm gonna coat the pan completely with butter. Now fold the apple and cranberries in, into the bread and make sure you gently fold it, making sure not to break any of the bread pieces. And then pour the mixture into the pan. Parchment paper and cover 
take the pan and tuck it underneath the sides. and put it back in um, at 350 degrees um, Fahrenheit for 15 more minutes. The, this is the final product of the brioche apple pudding and it smells and looks so delicious, so delicious and I know it'll taste great too. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and if you would like to make it, please comment down below um, how it turned out. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notifications so that you can get notified whenever I post a new video. See you guys next time. Bye!